no place to be right now. So fly away. Good. I'm glad you're able to talk to me. Go, I'll carry you back. Try to hold on. I'll go. The Eldian advance squad has been wiped out. What of the trench? It's hopeless. We can't dig any further. Falco, you look like you're drunk. Guess he must have hit his head pretty good. Who are you people? Where am I? I don't get it. Wasn't I just flying around with a couple of swords in my hands? This war has dragged on for four years now. But with this battle, we can end it. Once those ships are sunk, we'll have won this war for Marley. First of all, you can speak for yourself. Second, they want to judge us. They're choosing their next warrior. The successor to the Armored Titan. <laughs> Shut up. No, you don't. You've made it perfectly clear that you don't think any of us come close to you, Gobby. The difference between me and the three of you is that I'm prepared. Commander McGath, it's coming through now. What is... Sir! They're the Allied Forces' newest weapons, anti-Titan cannons. Line up the Eldians. Have them prepare for a charge. Yes, sir! This is a chance for the 800 Eldians here to atone for the past and serve our motherland with honor. Soldiers at the ready! Up! Prepare to attack! Guard the suicide squad! They'll charge the enemy bunker and disable their machine gun! Prepare to prove your worth! Yes, sir! If you'll let me, I'm sure that I can take out that armored train by myself. But if I pull this off, you can take out the train without needing to sacrifice that 800-man unit. That said, sir, if you really think I'm more valuable than 800 Eldian infantrymen, I get it. No. Gabby. Mark my words. I'll destroy that train and prove no warrior can that it deserves to inherit the armor more than me. With your permission, I'd like to remove my armband as well. Granted. It's a woman. A girl, really. Who cares? She probably is Eldian. Shoot her before she transforms. Wait for it. Here goes nothing! Yeah! Oh. <sighs> Gallard, you're up! <laughs> we should kill every one of you on sight! <laughs> Zeke will be our spear, and Rhyna our shield. You want to outshine the girl who just won this battle for Marley? by being a stickler for the laws of war. Tell him that I managed to stop his bleeding so he doesn't need to be afraid. Do not touch me. I'll be tainted. <laughs> it's beginning. Still has a number of anti-Titan cannons. I'm sick and tired of all these walls. What the? What hit me? Done. 
it's our failure that allowed this war to happen, Reiner. also made it clear to the whole world that the power of Titans would soon be eclipsed. Oh, no. I knew our soldiers would pull it off! We wasted four years squabbling over some peninsula's sovereignty. The weapons of mankind have at last grown strong enough to sunder Marley's armor. So we can't truly call it a victory for our nation, now can we? Our time's run out. We've been content to rely on the power of the Titans as we expand our colonial holdings. Meanwhile, countries that lack Titans to rely on developed weapons to oppose them. We don't have any Titans with wings, do we? Begging your pardon, General. Ah, Zeke, the boy wonder. Go right ahead. Reforming the army will take time, and the best way to buy that time is by giving the newspapers of the world a new headline to publish, something like this. Marley defeats the Devils of Paradis and seizes the power of all nine Titans. My father, Grisha Jaeger, set something great and terrible in motion on that island, and as his former son, I would like to be the end of it. Your beast is like a second founding titan. What makes you so special, Zeke? It's not like you have royal blood in your veins. The way I wipe my ass, it's real special. Too late. I want a full report. Uh, Commander. Commander! You tell me everything, down to the number of hairs on your ass. So, you believe you can conquer parody in a year? Considering the fact that none of those 32 ships have returned, I think it's clear that we're dealing with more than one titan. Wait! If I had inherited the armored titan nine years ago, then none of this would have happened. An ironically grand name for such a pitiful woman. What did you even do on that island anyway? Stumble around finding people to save you? Yeah. Hawk, we shouldn't pick on people who've been hit by artillery. By the way, Rhyna, you ought to visit Gobby and the others. They're worried about you. Right. Will do. If Titans become obsolete soon, what will that mean for us? Shit! Shit! Udo, Shit! <laughs> Raina! So, you're going to walk again? Yeah. I'm all right. Don't worry. Worry so much. <laughs> Wait! Not the first time I've seen her up there. She'll get the armor. Yeah. The girl who looks up to you more than anyone will inherit your Titan and will die at age 27. If I choose to report this, it'll be you and your family dropped out of an airship as Titans next. Inheriting one of the nine makes you an honorary Marley and... Surpass Gabi to protect her. Spare her from the dark future we face. Ah, oh, Zeke. Grandpa. Grandma. It's so good to see you. We're so very proud of all your achievements. I'm not done. Ma, I'll meet you all in a bit. Ugh, oh, crying out loud. Don't you know how to stand anymore? This is a sorry bunch of Eldians with mental trauma. It's from all that time digging on the front lines. Kaboom! <laughs> your armband's on the wrong side. It's okay, sir. I'm sure that you'll get better. Say, Rhyna, not to pry, but I hear you barely escaped from those devils with your life. As you know, I infiltrated their military. During our induction, one devil started eating a potato, but she stole it because it looked good. The time that we spent there was truly hell. 
Hey, good morning. Looks like all of us are here now. Can we all just meet for some tea? The Battle of Fort Slava made it clear the conventional weapons are advancing fast. We'll lose our tactical value as Marley loses her strength. And there is but one solution. Marley must seize the founding titan's power, as well as the resources of Paradis. The world must be reminded of the terrible threat that island poses to us all. The Tiber family will provide one for us. Yeah, but the Tibers have never once used the Warhammer Titan against an enemy state. They're known as the family that drove off King Fritz in the Great Titan War. They aren't hated like most Eltians. If we speak through the Tibers, the world will hear us out. Astute as ever, Peek. You're exactly right. They've never fought for their country or their people. Why should they get to play hero now? But they're... If it saves our motherland, Marley, that's enough for me. Our duty as warriors is to support the Tibers. Well said. Very soon a festival will take place here in Liberio. Foreign dignitaries and VIPs will be invited to hear this announcement from the Tibers. We will conquer Parody Island within the next year. The fates of the Eldian people and of Marley rest on this plan. We cannot let it fail. For the future of our motherland, Marley, we must join our hearts and minds as one. If this is all they're saying in private, I'm not concerned. I just wish Zeke hadn't thrown that comment in. Not here in this room, huh? <laughs> I have to go back to that damn island. We were abandoned. Abandoned by the devils whose blood runs through our veins. And it's why your father isn't here. Your father is Marlion. So it's against the rules for him to be with us. Oh, yeah. Back then, I strove to be a warrior so Mom and I could become Marleyans. Don't you want to become honorary Marleyans? In just a few years, we'll be sent to attack Parody Island. Out of us seven, six will be made warriors at once. No way! Huh? What are you excited for? Are you real strong? Real smart? No. You only made it this far by constantly going on about your love for Marley. Are you seriously insulting our mission? You almost sound like a stray restoration. You traitor! I knew it! I'll report you to the commander for this! Report this? Anyone can whine about how much they hate the island! That's why you'll be doing it here for the next 13 years! Here. I have to become a Marleyan. So I can live with my mom and dad. It isn't gonna be Porco's decision to make. And, well, loyalty's more important than he might think. Right, Annie? Huh? Don't know. I was distracted. You get 13 years, and that's it. But I'll be a hero for every one of them. If I can defeat the devils on parody, my parents will be proud to call me son. Uh, I wish something would happen. Aaron! I finally found you! They're even stronger than expected. The female titan. Its greatest strength is its versatility. Its hardened strikes are incredibly destructive. Leonhard is perfect. The armored titan naturally specializes in defense. As Marley's shield needs to stand tall where the fighting is thickest. It suits Brown's tenacious spirit. The jaw titan is an assault weapon with powerful claws and teeth that can crush almost anything. Marcel's sharp enough to keep up with it. The beast titan is more potent than ever. They can outperform an artillery unit with nothing but a fistful of rock. The cart titan's outstanding endurance makes it well suited for lengthy missions on the field. Peak's superior judgment will serve well here. There's the colossal titan. It is a god of destruction. We trust that Huva can handle it. But why send these children to take the founding titan? Frankly, I think it's a bit insane. We did just watch these children bring a nation to its knees. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out? You're at the bottom. Lina. I'm sorry. It's you, right? My mom used to work at this barracks. Look at my armband. Mom has one too. We're honorary Marleyans. So you're trying to get me hanged, is that it? Well, I'm running away as fast as I can. 
Away from you and your damned Eldian mother! That's right. Even if I don't have a dad, I was chosen to wield the armored titan. We're sure the king won't use the founding titan? What's wrong? Don't tell me you're feeling hesitant to kill these devils. Listen, Rena. The truth of it is, you were never supposed to be chosen. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rena. Why are you apologizing? Come on. Without Marcel to lead us, this mission's doomed. We've got to continue the mission as planned! What makes you so confident that you two won't get eaten right along with me? But how could someone learn to use it that quickly? You mastered the Colossal on your first try, so you tell me! You think the two of us will be blamed for running after you, huh? <laughs> We're not heroes, dumbass! The Marleans just see us as weapons! <laughs> Stop. Let her go. Our mission is done. We can go home. My father never wanted any part of us. Mom lived for a dream that she knew was hopeless. Before I die, I need to change something! Annie, Bertolt, I'm sorry. I'll be the warrior I should have been. I'm here to save humanity! What happened next is a blur, but I got away on my horse, alone, leaving behind three kids right about your age. Hello there, Missy. You must be a girl of refined taste to take such an interest in this old geezer. She only met my father once, but she described him to me in detail, so that I'd know you when I saw you. I made my sister a promise, so this tale of yours is a joke and a shit one at that. Daddy! Well, damn. Seems you've hit your rebellious phase. Come back! <laughs> but I hit my limit. Almost got caught. They'll be expecting a lot more than a few scraps of information. Yeah, we breach Wall Rose. It also means killing a lot of your friends. I keep telling you, Annie. The cadets aren't our friends. Could you please move your face away from mine? Hey, Ryder. How'd you get so strong? <laughs> keep moving forward. You're able to talk now, huh? Guess that means you're recovering. Minor fake. Huh? Will you report me? No, I wouldn't do that. There's another candidate who's way better than me. So there's no way that I'll be chosen. I'm glad to hear it. Huh? You're a good person. I hope you'll get to live a long life. Every day I've spent here, I've wondered... How did all these people let it come to this? Most of us were pushed. Some of us were pushed by other people. And some of us were pushed by the environments we grew up in. The few who do choose to leap into hell see it differently than the rest. And they're also able to see something beyond the hell. Maybe that something is hope. Or maybe it's just another hell. Fact is, you can only find out by moving forward. Falco, where are you headed this late? I left something at HQ, so I'm running back there to grab it real quick. I want to send a letter, but coming from the internment zone, it'll probably be checked, right? If they see what I wrote, they'll know I shouldn't be here. Would you be willing to send it from outside the internment zone? Hey. 
The Tiber family just arrived. Looks like all of them. I'm Willie, head of the Tibers. It's a pleasure. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. So I'm curious. Can you tell which of us is the Warhammer Titan? Frankly, I'm not even sure if the Warhammer came here with you. <laughs> but no, it is here. Someone among us wields the Warhammer. I came here to lay eyes on the statue of Helos. Truly, this is the spirit of Marley. Yes, I agree with you. Especially since the statue is completely hollow. <laughs> But if I had the ear of the man controlling Marley from the shadows, I would tell him it's too late. <laughs> you truly don't hold back, do you? We intend to reveal everything to the world during the main event of the festival. <laughs> Good morning, Puck. Hey, Peek. Why are you down there? I guess this just feels more natural to me. Sorry if I scared you. Would you please just walk normal? The Paradis plan seems to be coming right along. Like entrusting the whole operation to four children with no support? Falco just passed Gobby. Look how they celebrate that one win. Falco finally got the best of Gobby! Pretty impressive. It sounds like maybe you're gonna be the next armor. I'm doing this for you! What? Uh, that doesn't make any damn sense! Are they really gonna declare war from here in the internment zone? Sounds like all of Marley's problems are about to magically disappear. And if you two ever cheer for Falco over me again, I will make you cry. It's Commander McGath. No, sir. It belongs to the nation. And Marley is a nation commanded by none other than you, Lord Tiber. It just happened to be me. By sheer chance, I happened to be the man that fate turned to. It's thanks to what you said, Mr. Kruger. I'm gonna keep moving forward. I need to move forward, too. Would you mind if I sit next to you? My name's Jaeger. I'm an internment zone physician. Good to meet you. I'm Kruger. Before the Eldian restorationists were caught, that boy's uncle was a leading member. Hold on. Why tell me all this? So that you'll stop asking that young man to run errands for you. And if your heart and mind truly are healthy, you should go back to your family now. You have regrets about your own family? <sighs> I was so hard on my son. It's my fault! It's all my fault! <laughs> Please don't go outside on super. <laughs> But I spilled wine on my kimono and was just asking this boy for assistance. There's no telling what they would have done to you if I'd been honest, right? That woman's probably an Easterner from Hizuru. Let me bid you a warm welcome. Yesterday's enemy is today's enemy. Such a refined joke. All right, Willie! These people are known to be descendants of devils, but their ancestors massacred untold millions. Would the world not be better if Titans ceased to exist? There is but one answer to the Eldian question, and tomorrow night I'll share it. Now, to the playwrights and the witnesses of history. To the playwrights and the witnesses of history! <sighs> what the hell? Gobby! About time you woke up! Why is everything all crazy? And they opened up a bunch of food stalls! Here, try this! <laughs> it hurts. That's what you get for being a glutton. Look at the flags they put up. They should just make every day a festival. Think so, huh? It's probably nothing, but I've noticed a lot of new things have been happening in the last few days. Is that right? It feels strange. As if the world is about to change in a big way. Yeah. I hear you. Hey, how have you enjoyed the festival? Wait, where's Falco? Oh, 
He said he saw someone he knew in the crowd and ran off to say hi. Huh. Hope this doesn't make him late. Man, you really can't loosen up with that booze, can you? Look at all these people. Look there. I guess he made it back. <laughs> Mr. Brown! <laughs> Where the hell have you been? Sir, do you mind coming with me? Don't think there's time. Uh, you'll be fine. The curtains won't go up for a few more minutes. Over this way. What's this about, Falco? You can see for yourself in a second. Hmm. It's through this door. Okay. I got him to come. Evening. It's been four years. Reiner. 